A whole foods plant-based diet is demonstrated here by the power plate. Dr. Neil Barnard's group put this together. And we look at what the power plate shows here is a lot of things that you probably have no problems agreeing with. It has whole grains. It gets a little bit confusing because a lot of people think, well, aren't carbs bad? Well, most of the carbs that are really bad are the ones that have to deal with the refined carbohydrates, the sugar, the corn syrup, the white flour. But when you look at oatmeal, you look at whole wheat, whole grains, rye, brown rice, wild rice, just to name a few, are some examples of really healthy choices among the whole grains. The next one that we look at here is vegetables. About everybody agrees that vegetables are healthy. Next is looking at legumes. Not all of you may be familiar with, with what legumes are, but legumes actually have a great benefit. They are high in protein, high fiber, and help really do a great job of controlling blood sugars and keeping us full. They have other, many other nutrients that are involved as well. But a legume are beans, peas, and lentils. And the last is fruit. And most people know what fruits are. Um, there are many different types of fruits and all of them are, you can eat as much as you want. What's not on here is there's no dairy and there's no meat. And for most Western diets, that's a big part of their diet. Living here in Wisconsin, known as the cheese state, that's a big part of most people's diet. Everything, for many people, everything can go better with a little bit of cheese on this, a little bit of cheese on that. But that's not just in Wisconsin, that's throughout the country. There also is no added fat to this. One question that some people have is what about nuts? And what about um, olives, avocados, and those who have, at a simple level, there is some added fat. It's a plant base. It's probably healthier. In those who have known heart disease, we want to be even more, even stricter in controlling what level and keeping an eye on that. I've yet to have anybody come into me saying what they that they're, they're uncontrolled because they're eating avocados all day, they're eating nuts and almonds all day. I think that you having a, a small handful of nuts a day and, and trying to keep those in reason are going to be okay. If you have severe heart disease, it's probably worth really restricting or completely limiting those.